Well, good morning. Today I'm gonna have a little morning flow. I don't have a lot of time. I'm pretty sore and I need to go home still with my bike. So I need to ride like 15K. It's gonna take a long time and a lot of effort to pull this dog with me. So I'm just gonna have a little yoga flow to loosen up my muscles. I just wanna stretch a little because I feel better all day long just from a little flowing um, stretching session. So I really hope you're gonna enjoy this. It's I've been raining all night, so it's really wet outside. This is why I'm filming today indoors. Hope you're gonna enjoy. So let's come to the um, top of your mat. Stand up nice and tall. Feet are grounded to the floor. Really spread your toes wide. Roll your shoulders back. Pull in your core and just stand for a minute. Just getting grounded here. Grow taller with your head. Breathe. And then we're gonna breathe in. Inhale, arms up. Stretch up, really pull in your core and keep your core inside while exhaling, going down, maybe bending your feet a little bit, maybe they're tight. And really inhaling, exhaling, see how your back is feeling today. Pull in your belly still. Breathing, maybe straightening out your legs a little bit more. And then straighten your back. Stretch your back and fold forward again. Stretch your back straight. Maybe you need to have your hands on your thighs instead of the floor, if that's better. And fold forward. Last time, stretch your back. Straight back, pull on your belly. And let's place your hands down. If you don't have a dog, you can do it a little bit better. And let's come one leg down and really straightening up your back, opening up both legs down. And you're going to come to the floor. Chin, maybe to go all the way to the floor if you don't have a dog on your mat. And now let's come to upward facing dog, really stretching up. Maybe looking over one shoulder, over the other shoulder. Straight again. And let's come into child's pose just for a second, stretching out your back. And place your hands down and come into a downward facing dog. Draw your belly, keep your belly in. Maybe bending your knees and straightening them again. Maybe you want to walk your dog. Do whatever feels good for you this morning. Breathing deeply. And then you step the right leg forward again. Placing the knee down, opening up your chest here. Other leg forward, forward fold. Maybe bending your knees. Rising up, straightening up, and exhale, hands to your side. Inhale up, exhale, fold forward. Inhale, straightening your back, and then you step back with your left leg, opening up your chest, both legs back. And come forward, knees, chest, chin, or forehead, gliding through. You can stay always in a cobra or come into an upward facing dog. One more time, looking over one shoulder, over the other shoulder. Come into a child's pose, straightening out your back. Releasing, and then with the next exhale, come into a downward facing dog. Breathe here, pull in your belly, and then step forward with your left leg. 
place knee down and look forward. Keep your straight back. Always remember your core. Step with the other leg in forward fold. And come rise up, inhale. Delace the finger, stretch to one side. Stretch to the other side, really opening up your side body. Rising up and exhale again. A little flowing, a little bit faster. Inhale, straightening up your back and stepping your right leg back, opening up, placing both hands down, knees, chest, chin, or forehead, gliding through cobra or downward facing, upward facing dog, through a child's pose, into a downward facing dog. Right leg comes forward, placing your knee down, keep your back straight, pull, draw on your core, step forward, inhale up, grab the opposite wrist and stretch to the side, stretch to the other side, and again forward fold. Step your left leg back, straight back if you can. Step both the legs back. Stay here in a plank just for a second. Activate your core. And then he's just in full forehead, whatever feels better. Cobra. Upward facing dog. Quick child's pose. Into a downward facing dog. Breathe. Draw your belly. Left leg steps forward. Opening up. Both legs forward. Rise up. Again, grab your wrist. Stretch to the side. Stretch to the other side. This time you rise up. And you, maybe you want to go into a little back bending. Your chest really wants to draw up into the sky. And then slow forward fold. Maybe bend your knees with it. See how your back feels. Straightening up your back. And step your right leg like that. Now we're going to rise up. Come up with your arms and then stretch to the side, really dropping down and at the same time stretching the side body and really activating your core. Don't lose the touch with your core. Breathing, maybe rising up, looking up. Placing your hands down, step back, plank. Hold, activate your core here. Maybe coming from side forward a little bit back. And then knees, chest, chin. Stay here. Maybe this feels good for you. Maybe you want to interlace your finger behind your back and opening up your back. Hands on your mat, come into a little cobra, maybe into a little shalabhasana, if not, stay in the cobra, opening up. You don't want to come up that much, you just want to think about stretching everything, lengthening, growing taller and bigger. Come down, cobra or upward facing dog, through child's pose. Lengthening your back into a downward facing dog. Step your right leg back, forward, nice and forward. Rise up, interlace your fingers, and stretch to the side. Drop your body low, stretch at the same time to the side, engage your core. Breathe. Come up, look up, stretch further up. Pull up and at the same time you drop with your legs. 
and forward. Step with your other leg forward, forward fold. Rise up and forward fold one more time. Maybe you want to stay here, you want to hang here, or you want to interlace your fingers behind your legs. Loosening up your neck muscles. Maybe bending your knees a little bit. Rise up. Stretch to the side. Stretch to the other side. And last time, forward fold. Inhale, straightening up your back and step back with your left leg. Now we're truly opening up. Draw a little bit further down, placing the opposite arm as your leg down. And then maybe you want to just open up here or you want to pull in your leg. Really twist, lift, and twist. Breathe. Place your hands down. Step back. This time, plank. Maybe a chaturanga. Upward facing dog. Into a downward facing dog. Left leg steps forward. Knee drops down. Now, opposite arm comes down. Maybe you just want to twist. Easy twist. You can stay here. Make sure your leg doesn't drop to the side. Keep it in. And then grab your toes. Lift and twist. Your core is engaged. Really draw out that shoulder. Don't let it drop. Opening up. Breathe. Drop the leg. Pressing your hands down. Step forward. Straightening out your back. Last time, forward fold. Rise up. Now maybe you're up for a little opening up, a little back bending. If not, skip it. And rise up. Come standing, grounding your feet. Roll back your shoulders. Breathe. Maybe you really have a busy day and you need to go on with your day. So this is it then for you and you can just go and get ready. Maybe you want to put in a little Shavasana on your own. Do that. Feel free for it. I wish you a beautiful, wonderful day and I hope you feel open and stretchy and good all day. God bless you.